Well, one of the most unique festivals you'll ever see was celebrating its 40th anniversary over the weekend as thousands gathered on Leech Lake for the Eel Pout Festival. On this week's Northwoods Adventure, our Anthony Scott tells us more about Walker, Minnesota's biggest event. It's a one-of-a-kind event. You're not going to find another event like this in the rest of the world. Known for its ugliness, the Eel Pout reels in thousands of people to Leech Lake every year for a very unique celebration. Obviously, it's, it's about the Eel Pout in, in terms of the name and everything, but it's about the, the town of Walker and, uh, and everybody coming, to, coming together one time a year for, for a great festival. So what exactly is an Eel Pout? Another name for it is called Poor Man's Lobster. It actually has a texture of lobster and actually tastes really well. So um, some people really love to eat them. Others don't even like to catch them because they're real slimy and hard to get off the hook. So. However, its sliminess and ugly appearance didn't stop me from taking part in an eel pout festival tradition. Legend at the eel pout festival is that it's good luck if you give the fish a little smooch. And I could use some good luck. Many anglers could have used good luck as they competed in the eel pout fishing derby, but not everyone comes to Walker to fish. This is my sixth eel pout, I think, and uh, I come here to party. It's all about the good time. I've never even brought an auger here, honestly. <laughs> no. I've never wet a line. <laughs> no, never. All you need to know is that's the only eel pout that needs to be here. So uh, we, we tried fishing our first year and we flooded our area out. So. From a learning curve, we uh, learned a lot. Whether it's to fish or just have a good time, there is something for everyone at Eel Pout. But with Cass County not allowing vehicles on the ice this year for safety reasons, attendance was lower than normal. This year with the conditions being a little bit tougher, uh, numbers are down a little bit, but we'll see. We still have the rest of the day today and part of tomorrow on Sunday. But if you're going to make the trek to Walker for next year's festival, there's a couple things you want to remember. If you ever want to come to Eel Pout, wear good boots and uh, bring a smile because we don't want anybody angry here. Reporting from Walker for this week's Northwoods Adventure, Anthony Scott, Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.